It's now time for Remember When with Uncle John. John Guess, Washita County's resident storyteller and local historian. Sit back now and enjoy a walk down memory lane as John recalls the days of yesteryear in his own unique way. You never know, some of it might even be true. So here's Uncle John, along with his trusty sidekick, Kelly Blair. Back on Remember When with Uncle John. Well, we have done it. We have reached finish line Friday, the last one of December 2022. Last one of 2022, period. And, of course, around here, these pots, that means we have got a top tune to be talked about. Late on us, Johnny. Well, you know, this is a country station. This ain't exactly country music, but it ain't rock and roll either, so eh. it ain't hard rock and roll. But well, no. My good friend Steve Purifoy lives up in Benton right now, born and raised over here on Chestnut Street, proud Camden Panther. His favorite artist of all time is Dan Fogelberg. Oh, okay. And Dan Fogelberg was a very unique, very wonderful uh, entertainer. Passed away in 2007 from cancer. And they have started a big push to get him into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. All right. Uh, Facebook is full of petitions to sign and all sorts of things like that, you know, to try to get him in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. But... One of my favorite Dan Fogelberg songs is Same Old Lang Syne. There you go. And it's a good song, and it's New Year's Eve, and, and uh, you know, the whole schmear, and everybody's all, you know, wrapped up in the holidays and all that stuff. And, and uh, there are some of those, some of us that are sad. You know, you think about people that are gone and things that ain't the same anymore, and it's, it's kind of a sad song, but it fits the mood, it fits the day. And uh, it's for uh, it's for Dan Fogelberg, and it's for my good buddy Steve Purefoy. Absolutely. It would definitely fit for what's going on in this time and everything. A lot of people going through some hard times and everything. But you know what? Uh, old Ang, <coughs> excuse me, Old Lang Syne, you might as well uh, sing this song because you don't know the no- uh, words to Old Lang Syne. No, absolutely not. <laughs> For to be so popular and to be something that everybody sings on uh, Christmas, uh, New Year's Eve, I mean, nobody knows the words. This is this is song for drunk people. Yeah. He, oh, he, uh, he, rec- he recorded it in 1980. It came out in 1981 as a single. Uh, one of my favorite Dan Fogelberg songs. And uh, like I said, it's for Steve Purefoy, for, uh, for New Year's Eve, for Steve Purefoy, and for... They've got some people in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame now. We've talked about this before. I don't put any credence in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame if it ain't got Ted Nugent in it. Exactly. And Ted Nugent will never get in it because of his politics. But some people are in there that deserve it. And Dan Fogelberg deserves to be in there. Most definitely. And I hope that someday he gets in there. Well, even though he's trying to get into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, when you listen to this song, just give it a listen, folks, because it's going to sound just as country as anything else on the country charts today. Absolutely. It's definitely not traditional country, but it's as country as anything. All those guys who used to do Southern rock and everything, they'd be in country music today. Yeah, absolutely. So, I mean, you know, don't, don't knock it. You got any New Year's resolutions real quick, John? Uh, just keep doing Remember When with Uncle John and Kelly and uh, satisfying the masses and uh, uh, giving the people what they want and uh, uh, not much on Monday and nothing on Friday, Tuesday, except Wednesday, Tuesday. Thursday, and Friday. <laughs> and and uh, just keep chugging along. Going to build me another motor scooter and drive my old 55 and and, uh, and just try to, try to keep chugging along and, and uh, doing the radio show here with my good friend Kelly and and uh, continue on our uh, on our meteoric rise to fame and fortune. There you go. I have no New Year's resolution. Ten years ago, the only resolution I've ever kept is to quit doing New Year's resolutions. Yeah, I'm going to be the same old lovable train wreck I'm still doing today. So. Absolutely. <laughs> All right. We'll, we'll see you next week, folks. That's going to wrap up Remember When with Uncle John, not only for the day, but for the week, for the year. We'll see you in 2023, John. I want to wish all of our fo- uh, loyal and faithful followers out there and listeners Happy New Year from Uncle John and Kelly, and uh, drive safe. Don't drink and drive. Uh, Enjoy yourself. Have a good time. Eat plenty of food. Have a great time. Don't drink and drive. Be a decent human being. Be a decent human being, and uh, uh, listen to Remember When with Uncle John and Kelly. We'll see you next week. See you next week, Kelly. You've been listening to Remember When with Uncle John on Y95. 
This broadcast can be heard each weekday morning at 645 on South Arkansas's favorite station, Y95.